With your look around the Air Force, I'm Staff Sergeant Khadija Slaughter. The KC-46A Pegasus was just approved for combatant command deployments worldwide. That means the new refueler passed its final capability test, the end of a 15-month process to prove the Pegasus can refuel all aircraft combatant commanders may need. The Pegasus passed the final test during a real-world tasking in a combat zone, refueling two F-15E Strike Eagles. The flight included the first successful combat use of the military data network, a system that allows the KC-46 to be a secure interface between the on-ground air operations center and airborne aircraft, increasing situational awareness in the battle space. Enlisted and civilian women can now apply and compete for an officer training school commission while pregnant. The previous policy required women to be worldwide qualified at the time of application, preventing them from applying during pregnancy and through a 12-month postpartum period. The new recruiting policy allows selectees to attend training between six and 14 and a half months after their pregnancy. Under Secretary of the Air Force, Gina Ortiz-Jones, says the service is in a race for talent and policies need to reflect that. The change came about after she directed a gender policy review to identify obstacles women face in the department. The Air Force added a new guide to its collection of foundational documents dedicated to developing total force airmen. The Joint Team Documents, also known as the Purple Book, provides an understanding of the value each service contributes to the Joint Force and outlines working with other branches to win the high-end fight. The Purple Book educates airmen on how the Air Force partners with other services to protect American interests across the globe. Chief Master Sergeant of the Air Force Joanne Bass says, in an era of strategic competition, adversaries want to outpace and overtake the U.S. She says every airman needs to know what's at stake and understand why it's critical to synchronize capabilities with joint partners. And that's your look around the Air Force.